All right, uh, let's look at the homework 4.4, problem number three, all right? So uh, let's use L'Hopital's rule, uh, if it applies, uh, to evaluate this uh, uh, limit here. All right, so uh, first thing is that we have to check, as the x approaches zero, seven to the zero is one. So one minus one approaches zero, all right? Zero times anything, so numerator approaches zero, all right? So we have that. Then uh, what we can do is uh, we can just, uh, t you know, we can apply L'Hopital's rule here. So by applying uh, L'Hopital's rule, we get, uh, we still have the same limit as x approaches zero. All right, then we just need to take the derivative of the numerator and the denominator separately. All right, so derivative of that would be power rule. Derivative of x is one times uh, second guy, seven x, seven to the x, plus uh, x times, derivative of seven to the x would be seven to the x times natural log of seven. All right, so we got that. Then on the bottom, uh, you're going to have, uh, let's see, uh, natural log of 7 times uh, 7 to the x and a minus 1. So uh, I'm going to actually, um, oh, actually, we can't do that one. Uh, let's see. All right. And uh, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Let's see. All right. All right. So we have that. It looks kind of. Um, but uh, as x approaches uh, 0, uh, you can see that uh, this guy, uh, 7 to the 0 is going to approach 1. This is going to approach uh, 0. Right? This is going to approach uh, 7 to the 0 is 1, so it's going to be natural log of 7. Right? So you can see that uh, this is just going to be uh, 1 on top over natural log of 7. Right? So let's type it in. Uh, 1 over natural log of 7. Alright, so let's submit for testing. Alright, it came back and looks like we got this one correctly. Alright, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.